I'm Ryan from Burley. Today I'll show you how to install the Dash RM Child Bike Seat to a bike. 
be sure to confirm that your bike is compatible with the Dash RM prior to purchasing it. You can check out our Dash RM fitment video for an easy compatibility checklist. Let's dive in. First, be sure your rear bike rack is securely attached to your bike according to your rack's manufacturer's instructions. Next, open the rack clamp by rotating the adjustment knob counterclockwise. Keep rotating until the rack clamp is wider than the bike rack, then place the dash onto the rack. Before tightening the adjustment knob, make sure the bike seat is properly aligned on the bike rack using the center of gravity indicator on the outer plastic shell of the bike seat. The center of gravity indicator must be positioned either in front of the bike's rear wheel axle or no more than 3.93 inches, 10 centimeters, behind the bike's rear wheel axle. If needed, move the dash forward on the rack until it's in the correct position. Once the dash RM is properly positioned, rotate the adjustment knob clockwise until the rack clamp begins to secure around the rack. Ensure the rack clamp is properly fastening to the bike rack tubes before continuing to rotate the adjustment knob. Keep tightening the adjustment knob until the bike seat is securely attached to the rack. During the last few rotations, the locking ring should make audible clicking noises. Once the adjustment knob is fully tightened, the locking ring should prevent it from rotating counterclockwise. Next, we'll secure the safety strap. To do this, simply loop the safety strap around the seat tube and connect the buckle. Pull on the free end of the safety strap until it's tightly secured to the bike frame. Be careful to ensure the free end of the safety strap is not able to come in contact with the wheel of the bicycle. If needed, wrap the strap around the seat tube multiple times before securing the buckle. Now that the bike seat is installed, check that all parts of the bicycle function correctly when the dash RM is attached. To buckle your child into the seat, make sure the bike is stable and that the dash RM is securely attached before placing them in the seat. Next, snap the shoulder straps and waist straps into the five-point harness buckle and adjust the straps so they fit securely. This can be done by loosening or tightening the adjustment points on each of the five harness straps like so. For additional adjustment, the shoulder straps can be raised up or down depending on the child's size. To do so, begin by accessing the harness bracket on the back of the dash RM. Rotate the bracket sideways and slide it through the hole and the slot in the seat pad. Then, pass the bracket through the upper harness position hole and rotate it so it's secure against the seat back. Repeat on the other shoulder strap, making sure neither strap becomes twisted while adjusting. When adjusting from the upper harness position to the lower harness position, the bracket must be passed back through the slot in the seat pad before passing it through the lower harness position hole. Once the harness is adjusted to fit your child, secure the child's feet using the straps on the footrest. Make sure they're comfortable and that the snaps are snug but not too tight. You can adjust the height of each footrest to four different positions to keep passengers safe and comfortable. Simply release each footrest from the bike seat by squeezing the tabs on the rear of the footrest together and rotating the footrest up and away from the seat. Then, reattach each footrest by inserting the hook into the appropriate notch in the seat and rotate the footrest down and toward the back of the seat until the tabs lock into the notch in the seat. For optimal comfort and safety, the footrest height should be set to allow the child's knees to bend at a 90 degree angle. Now you're ready to ride with your favorite co-pilot. At the end of the ride, press the yellow release button on the five-point harness to remove the child. To remove the dash RM from the bike, detach the safety strap by releasing the buckle. Then pull the locking ring toward the adjustment knob and rotate the adjustment knob counterclockwise until the rack clamp is wider than the width of the bike rack. Lift the dash RM up off of the bike rack and remove it from the bicycle. Check out the dash RM product manual for full safety guidelines maintenance info, and a pre-ride safety checklist to ensure you and your little ones stay safe on every ride.